She need one bad, and that's the one time her huh, get the chance. But if she like y'all, y'all good, y'all straight, bro. Hell no. Nah. But this dude got me thinking. Why is he doing this? She must miss. You feel me? Yeah. She must have already given yeah. him the feeling or something. But yeah, let's start that. Bit. You right? Now, if Alexia right. would be willing to trade for Alex, it's a brand new car. He probably said. Alexia to come here by herself. 
and we wanted her to come by herself because Alex now, is going to ask her on a date. Like, imagine if Alexia rolled up with her tag. And she Alex don't take some right away. To ask her on Tell a date her what the deal is. is. Now, of course, there was no guaranteeing that and Alexia would come by herself. You know what I'm but to try to stack the odds at least in her favor, I texted a couple of my friends and I asked them if you were going to go to the real I'm going to be on the list. Would you check it out by yourself or would you take someone with you and why? Now, some of my friends said that they would go alone, but the majority said that they would take someone with them for either a second opinion, for safety concerns, or because they knew nothing about cars and they just wanted to make sure that the car was a good deal. So after gathering this data, we came to the conclusion that there was a very Bro, high probability that Alexia would also come yeah. to the park with someone Why else the because of these very reasons. So we decided to address these concerns. We had Jay re-emphasize to Alexia that the car was in very good, practically new condition. This would hopefully oh. ensure that Alexia Alexia didn't think that the car was a ripoff. We also had Alex set the meetup day and time in the middle of a weekday when most people would be working, including Jay himself. This would hopefully ensure that if Alexia asked someone else to come with her, hopefully they will say that they couldn't because they had to work. Now granted, yes, Alexia could have just told Alex to reschedule to a different day, but we try to be ready for that too. In one of the yeah, initial texts that Alex sent to Alexia, yeah. we had him emphasize that he was going out of town yeah. and could only show yeah. Alexia the car at yeah. his preferred yeah. day and time. Yeah. Being yeah. that the car was such a good deal, Alex also told Alexia that he couldn't guarantee that the car would still be available at a later live. date. I mean, and then finally, like and most importantly, we had Jay oh, vouch yeah. for Alex. This would hopefully ensure that Alexia wouldn't think that Alex was a creep. Is it illegal to ride butt naked in your own car? I feel like that should be legal if you have tennis, right? And so with all of our bases covered as best as we could cover them, and with Alexia on her way, all that was left to do now was simply wait. Soon enough, after about Let's a good see. 20 minutes, Let's Alexia see. ended up giving Alex a call like that video. she was here. Leave a comment. Tell us what you think. Hello? Oh, Alex is getting a call on his phone? I'm here. I just parked. I'm not sure where you're at. <laughs> all right, let me get out of here. Oh, I think I see you over there. Okay. Okay. So Alexia just gave Alex a call right now that she is here. Did you see her pull in? I didn't even see her pull in. Alex right now is getting out of his car and going towards her. He is Bro, waving her down, it looks like. Okay, there she is. Oh, she parked all the way over there. Wow. So is this a car? Oh, let's get this pop. Maybe you just hop better? Uh, don't, uh, don't worry about it. You're getting your steps in. Hey, in that motherfucker? Okay, here we go. You're in for this journey. She better not fall for it. She's making already making her walk hella far and stuff. She's already in bad shape, bad situation. How you doing? I can't complain. Did you have a good drive over? Yeah, was good. Not the traffic. Yeah, I'm out. Alexia? Alexia, nice to meet you. So after days of preparation, hours of setting up, and about 30 This is what you're getting. You this is 2020. See, super new, super clean. As planned, Alex gets right into it and begins letting Alexia check out the car. Check out the car. It only has about like 6,000, 7,000 miles on it. Other than a little bit of bird dookie on it, it's real clean, yeah? I said, hey, throw the black ones on there, you know? It always looks good in black. Yeah. Boy, get in, get in, check it out. Alexia jumps into the car and begins checking out the interior. Everything so far has gone off without a hitch, but this is where things could have gotten dicey. Remember, in the backseat of the car, we had our hidden camera, and we didn't want Alexia to find it because then she's either going to get suspicious or really creeped out. So to prevent this from happening, we locked the rear doors and prayed that Alexia was cool with checking out the back seats from the front of the car. I'm going to take that charger with you. You're going to get the car. Oh, nothing extra? I just, I have a couple other cars. I don't need it. Plus, it's always good to help somebody out, right? I could just go sell it back to a dealership or some shit like that. If you need it, you can work something else. Another way that we try to prevent Alexia from finding her camera was by having Alex emphasize and draw her attention more to the exterior features of the car versus the interior. You see how I turn the tire right here just a little bit, give you that fast and the furious look? That fast and the furious look with the tire right here. I don't even know what number they're on right now. What do you think of what it on Alex? Oh, he's cool. He's a really cool guy. You know, he got the height and everything else, I guess, but, you know. It's the height. 
<laughs> all my dudes. That's all dude. it takes nowadays, just be 6'3". Six. <laughs> so far, is she doing okay? Back here. I don't know what you get down with. Okay, Mike, you know something. Like everybody got different opinions. Like yeah. Cardboard and carpet. Cardboard and carpet. Yeah. So we're upgrading on the... Right now, you're doing so far. I don't know it's too far. It's not looking too crazy so far, but I don't yeah, know. This guy yeah, has a lot to say. Crazy. He has a lot of personality, so dude. I'm telling you, I'm sweating this car, man. <laughs> Alex has a lot of personality, dude. He's got great personality. Uh -huh. he, he makes everyone just feel very comfortable, you know? So. All right, so what you thinking? Like, can you see yourself in this? Completely. Going out mm. Saturday night? Yeah, I need yeah. to check the windows out a little bit. A little bit? Like, yeah. you oh, you don't want to be seen, man. What kind of car does she currently drive? It says she. Uh, she drives a Malibu 2012. Oh, nice. Not a bad car. Yeah, it's, it's not it's some bad 2012. You said it was. Uh, you wanna in the block? The crazy Take for it for a little test drive. Uh, <laughs> she really thinks she's gonna be behind the car, but. Want to start oh, an she happy in the city from the dude like. Ooh. Over to oh, oh, my God. And watch your store. It fit me. She a imagining herself in this shit. Just in the seats. A little bit more? Yeah. Sorry. Right, <laughs> so after checking out the car, yes, Alexia yes, was now yes. ready to take it for a test drive, which means that we are inching closer and closer to the moment where Alex will be offering Alexia the car for free in exchange for going on a date with him. Okay, so they're off. So we're going to lose him on the mic right here. I'm hoping she makes me proud. Fingers crossed. Fingers and toes crossed. <laughs> Fingers and toes crossed. So we have lost them on the mic because they've gone out of range, so they left for the test drive. Everything seems like it's going good, though, no? So far, so good, man. So far, so good. Let's hope it stays that way. Yeah. I don't know how you feel, but I know it's always weird. It sounds like he had a doubt. Yeah. I feel like he had to be the reason why he did it. Okay, do you think it's going to happen? That's good. <laughs> do you think we're going to miss something? Well, she better focus on the road. Yeah, so that's a good idea. <laughs> Is that there's a camera rolling inside of the car? So if anything, after the test, we'll be able to like watch it and listen in to see exactly what happens. But I don't think anything's gonna happen. I think they're just gonna test drive it, bring it back here, and then that's when Alex is gonna make his move. And you know what? I like the optimism. You like the optimism? <laughs> I like that. Nothing will happen. Let's manifest it. <laughs> Nothing at all is gonna happen. Nothing is gonna happen. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I thought those were all like hookups right here, like the charger. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the charge tip phones. Yeah, I'm, I'm one of them. They really changing the their emojis to like how they're Alright, so on a scale of 1 to 10, how confident do you feel right now? Honestly, I feel like a 5 out of 10. Like, okay. I'm confident, but I'm also pretty nervous. Okay, so that's good. Know, man. That's good. Under the right circumstances, anybody can fall. Right, right. So, yeah, exactly. It's crazy. Are you prepared for the possibility that she might feel the sex? I don't know. I have more faith in her than anything. After a good 10 minute test drive, Alexia eventually makes her way back to the park. Oh, here they are. Okay, we have them coming back. Okay, we, got, we, we have them coming back, guys. We have connection again. Now, in order to get Alexia in perfect line of our cameras once again, we made sure to tell Alex to instruct her on where to park. <laughs> I feel like that's a black people thing. Black people always back in the furnace bus. The moment of truth has finally arrived. Alexia has checked out the car. She has test driven it, and Alex will now offer her a huge fat quote unquote discount. The question now is will Alexia remain loyal to her boyfriend Jay, or will she be willing to trade him for a relationship with Alex and a brand new car? Mm, mm, mm. He's here. Alright, so what you think, man? I know uh, he told you the budget. Okay, before we go any further, I have to address something here. See, unfortunately, after getting back from the test drive, Alex's mic didn't reconnect well, and it kept cutting in and out. Here, check it. This is Alex's mic track. This is before the test drive, this is during the test drive, and this is after the test drive. See all these dips? These are the moments where Alex's mic completely cut out, and we couldn't hear anything. Unfortunately, we didn't have any backup audio, and at one point in this conversation, the mic completely cut out for good. So in summary, the audio will sound like shit at some points, and I'll be voicing over other portions, and yeah, I apologize, I'm really, really sorry, I was honestly not gonna upload this video because of this reason, but I decided to, because trust me, it's still gonna be good.
I'm saying you're looking real cute in the car, so I feel I feel like you should really take this off my hand. For real, I feel you're a nice little dude. But, um, I don't know what you got going on, but if you want to actually like maybe go out sometime, I'll throw you a deal, an even better deal. Yeah. I mean, we could throw some thousands off. Or depending on how we vibe, we can, I'll just oh, give it to you. You would. I told you, like, I'll, I'll bowling ball this car down the street and not even give a shit. I mean, I'm trying to help you out anyway. Like, you know what I'm saying? My boy said you needed some help, so I'm trying to upgrade. We can put you in this. Have you looking sexy in this right here? I know you said you wanted to... Oh, no, this freaking mic keeps getting out. Oh, Jesus, sorry, sorry. It's like, is that not reconnecting well, or we're just freaking far now? So one of the first moments where our mic cut out was when Alex was describing to Alexia the kind of date that he would take her on if she accepted his offer. Luckily, though, we didn't miss much, and we were able to somewhat reestablish a connection with Alex's mic. You know what I'm saying? We can go rooftop pool. Even though you're hooking it up, but... Yeah, I mean, shit, you can leave your wallet at home if you want to. <laughs> it's really no big deal. What the... What? Well, I the sip. Come on, man. I... Bro. Yeah. Hey, I ain't gonna lie, I know what? dude was hurt. Like, I know he would listen to every word, but. Why? Would I thought he was listening to every word. Right now, honestly. Like, I got a little bit of free time before we gotta go. We can just talk about it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we can discount just a little. If we call it like a little first date, how about that? You see it up, but he was like. Uh, you don't think about it too. Uh, like, uh, she said, I don't know. <laughs> I'm so, sorry, I'm, so sorry, I'm 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 so sorry, i am so sorry 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 i am so Ah, no, I'm not that person. I'm not that person. Phone stays in my pocket, you get my undivided oh. attention. Yeah. It's like going out, I'm all yours. Mm. Uh, okay. That's my baby. You gonna pass? You gonna pass me and the deal? Yeah. That's what I love to hear. I believe. Oh, <laughs> oh, damn. <laughs> oh, damn. Rejected. Is he getting rejected? Man, I gotta give it to you full price. You're playing around. <laughs> <laughs> now I'll just play. I just give you a discount. But are you sure? Like, I'm, I'm gonna give you a little. Think about it a couple more times. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What you mean? Now, this is where Alex's mic completely cut out for good. Not but from trust what me? we heard, and after continuing to analyze Alexia's body language, it appeared as if she was just not going for it. Okay, we can't hear anything anymore, and I'm not trying to get your excited, in Jane, but it looks like she is saying no. Oh, shit. <laughs> uh, I wasn't worried at all, man. <laughs> because we hardly post yeah, passes yeah, yeah. on this channel is that whenever someone passes the, the test we always have contingency plans obviously alex really isn't selling this card but we can't let well, alexia know that see it's not our job or place to tell alexia that this was all a test oh, jay's got to be oh, the one yeah. to do that so to continue making this entire scenario yeah. seem real alex told alexia that he was taking the car to get detailed in about two hours and that if she really wanted it she could take it off his hands then Like you doing in a place like this, and it's so much better now. Wait, so now what? Do we just let her walk? And she, she's leaving. You don't even have time to. Do you want to catch up to her and tell no, her? No, 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 no. I'll tell her about it later. I think some things are best left unsaid. Don't tell her about it later. Oh, Alex is calling. <laughs> Alex is calling you. Pass the test. That's all that matters. Hello. See it, man. Hey, hey, gotta hey, see it, man. Gotta see it. Yeah, yeah, right. Gotta She's the one. Right. That's what it looks like. See. We gotta get married now. We gotta get married. <laughs> Are you gonna tell her that you put her in the 
Absolutely not, man. I think I'm just keeping a secret for right now. <laughs> You're going to keep that to yourself, huh? Yeah, she passed the test. That's the most important thing. That's all I care about. <laughs> Okay, so I want to ask you guys two last and final questions. The first question is, do you guys I mean, think Alexia passed the, the internet, test? So. I personally think that she did. Now, do you guys agree or do you guys disagree? Being able to look back at the footage now and being able to make up the audio a little bit better, it did sound like Alexia was thinking about it. However, maybe she was just thinking about it because she felt awkward or uncomfortable or maybe she was just being nice. I don't know. What do you guys think? Now, the second thing that I want to ask you guys is that if you guys were Jay, would you guys have stepped out of the car and told your boyfriend or your girlfriend that you had just put them to the test? Yes or no, and why? For me personally, honestly, I don't think I would. <laughs> Damn, dude! <laughs> All right, man. See that? That's, that's really it. That's the, really the most of that bit, you feel me? I don't want to carry this on too long. Man, make sure y'all like this, man. Like this up, man. Subscribe. You feel me? Leave a comment. Just a little, you know. I'm gonna I'm try to make this as raw as I can. You feel me? I'm probably gonna have a few cuts because I fucked up a few times. <laughs> but we all do that. We all yeah. fuck up. You feel me? Yeah. So, stay tuned for the next one. Oh, yeah. I ain't forget. Click every link in my bio. You feel me? Every link. All them bitches. It's gonna help you out. Pull up. You gotta tell them. Go watch your last few videos. Go watch my last few videos, man. Go watch his last few videos, man. I'm gonna put the playlist popping up right here. Yes, sir. That bitch just popped up. You feel me? Your playlist. Yes. Did you see it? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, man. All the type of shit. Matter of fact, I'm gonna pop all the type of shit up in the video. But yeah, man. Y'all fuck with me, man. Y'all want some more content? Just stay tuned. And yeah, that's it.